Alright everyone, welcome back to episode 6 of Nino Kuni Wrath of the White Witch. Continuing on, I've done a little bit of leveling off camera. We don't need to watch this again. I've done a little bit of leveling. We're all, um, we're all level 10. Even Nanners. Why did, why do I keep calling him that? Even Monkey. I regret calling him Monkey now. Yeah, I know it is. This pebble pelt seems to be quite powerful. Okay, he got the tail spin off before we had to switch characters. That's good. Also got this move, I haven't tried yet. Oh, it did 26, that's quite a bit. Yeah, I'm going. Nice. Okay, stop it, ow. Um. No effect. Nice. That wasn't hard this time. See, if I just took my time the first time coming through, I feel like I wouldn't have died at all. Because if I took my time, I would have leveled up a bit more. All right. You dirty rats, I'll get you next time. Yeah, sure you will. Nickers, he got away. And he got another stupid cat fridge in before we let him... Let... Eh. And he got a stupid another catch phrase in before he left and all. That was weird. Never mind that, Mr. Drippy. What about King Tom? You're right, man. We'd better see how is, how's he doing. Your ma your meow just see. How are you okay? Oh, it's you. Come on, King Face. Pull yourself together. One's wand. One's retrieved it from the villain who per purloined it. Whatever. Nickers, 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 Nickers. Your Majesty, your Majesty. Okay, so we need the wand and we need to heal. The zodiacs are assembled, your radiance. I thank you all for attending. Very well. I hereby call the council to order. You are all doubtless aware of the purpose of this session. We are here to discuss the elimination of the pure-hearted one. Come before us, Dark Jin. You summoned me. It's Shaddaa. The so-called savior from the other world. He must be destroyed. Shaddaa, it is time that you proved yourself worthy of the title of executor. On one condition. Ha! The insolence! He presumes to bargain with our queen? Go on. Very well. I must request that you entrust this task to me and me alone. Hear me, members of the Council. I have no need of your aid. He thinks himself our equal. What gives him the right? He is either very brave or very To presume to give us orders. Babbling fools. Silence! Very well. You will have your wish, Shadar. I entrust the task entirely to you. Teach those who speak of a savior. The futility of their hope. It shall be done. This Oliver 
this savior, I will taint his heart with the blackness of despair. Huh. Well then. If one thanks if one thanks you once, one thanks you a thousand times. You saved one's life back there. Looks like you're feeling a bit better now, eh, your meowjesty? But you weren't kidnapped after all. There there's funny, my reckoning was a bit off. You don't think I'm losing my touch, do you, Ollie boy? I'm just glad the king is safe. That's the most important thing, isn't it, your meowjesty? Hmm, never mind all of that. One is just perfectly livid. Livid? That that villain Hickory Doc got the better of me. Okay. And all because the loss of one's enthusiasm led one to be caught catnapping. To think he managed to purloin one's greatest treasure. It's unforgivable. But one's bond is back in one's possession now. That's the main thing. Now one can finally bestow it upon you. Thank you, your majesty. Bring forth one's wand. This is one's magic wand. When one was a kitten, one ran quite wild with the old thing. Here, it is yours now. That's a nice looking wand. Thank you very much, your majesty. If you know who finds out about this, one fears we shall both live to regret it. But one Sorry if you guys can hear the planes in that. We have lots of fires you around. you you know who? You mean Shadar, don't you? Eh? Uh, there's no need to say it out loud, is there? But yes, that is who one means. Your Majesty, you've gone and given him the wand now. There's no going back. One supposes so. Don't worry, your Majesty. I'll bring down Shadar. You'll see. Sounds like that plane's just never leaving. You obtained a magic wand. There's planes and helicopters all around because of the fires. Now for coming to one's aid in one's hour of need, let one also persist you with some new magic. One hopes it will prove, prove, prove useful. You received a page describing the frostbites, but ooh, nice. Ooh, thanks again, your majesty. I can't wait to try it out. I'm going to become the best wizard ever. Hmm, really very eager, aren't you? In that case, there is a forest south of one's kingdom known as Golden Grove, and beyond it lies a vast de desert. In the midst of that desert is the city of Almamoon. Al you must travel there next. You know, it's really somewhat... is somewhat... But never mind that Rash had Rashad, one of the four great sages once dwelled there and still does, one presumes. The great sages, you mean the proper mighty wizards Alicia used to be one of? Alicia. If you wish to expand your magical knowledge and one is sure of the age of that. If you wish to expand your magical knowledge, one is sure the age aid of the sages will prove invaluable invaluable really thank you your majesty right oh it's also off across the desert to find us a great sage then isn't it tidy alma moon here we come yeah alma moon here we come got the new wand There was also a chest in there, like down in the sewers that we could get with the new wand. I tried to use the spring lock spell, but it said that it was too weak. So this wand should do it. But I might just come back later. Because there was another thing down there, and I don't really want to do that on camera anyways. Are you wanting something? Oh. A ding dong doll mother is worried about her sons who haven't come home yet. Agree to help them out. Okay.
I'll do those off camera. Ding dong dell. Here we here we go, Ollie boy. Now our adventure really begin can really begin. You've even got yourself a proper wand and everything. I bet you're excited, eh? I sure am. Why did you stop me? You didn't have to stop to have that conversation. Okay, so we're going all the way over yonder. Oh no. Oh, they're running away from me. Ha <laughs> ha! That's cool. Even the, like, the bird dude that I haven't fought in yet. That's cool. Oh, they disappear eventually. What if I want to fight them, though? Or a Boros? Oh, I have no... Ah, oh, shoot. He's asleep. We did it. Didn't realize I was still out of MP. Okay, so we're going through this these forests. Is it these forests or this forest? I guess it's this forest. Golden Grove. 11.20 and it's 11.12 minutes in the episode. Well, 12 minutes into the recording. Golden Grove, Forest of Plenty. Is that like the Valley of Plenty from The Witcher? Which I haven't played yet. Here we are, Golden Grove. A quick stroll through here and we'll be... I'll, we'll bet be out the other side and into the desert no time tidy. Jeepers creepers, just look at those giant mushrooms. It's so different from the deep dark wood. You're not wrong, Ollie boy. It's another type of woodland altogether. This is no offense to old tree face, but the soil by here is just better. Proper fertile it is. The trees are weighed down with fruit and nuts all the all the year round. That's why they they call it the forest of plenty, see? The forest of plenty, huh? Uh it's been a while since I dropped by. There's there's nostalgic full of la, 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 la. There's nostalgic full of fairies this old place is. Shall I give the boys a shout? Yes, please, Mr. Drippy. Oi, how do boy how do boys how do boys? Anyone about it's me, Drippy. Nobody's home. What? No welcoming committee for the Lord High Lord of the Fairies? Something proper weird is going on, man. No fairies in town and none in the forest neither. What's happened to them all? Maybe we should go deeper into the forest. We might be able to find out more there. Well, since we're going that way anyways, let's just push on through to Alma Moon and see what we can see, shall we? Okay. Boy, I sure hope we get to meet some of your fairy friends, Mr. Drippy. All right, let's get our MP back. And you know, I do want to save. Because we've been through a lot of talking and I don't want to have to do that boss fight again. My main thing is not wanting to do the talking again. Hey, check, ooh, a new enemy. He's cool. He's got a he's got like a spear or like a battle axe. Let's use cut loose. These guys are all plants though, so if I wanted to, I could really I could use Oliver and burn them all. And I'm actually really starting to like the monkey. I got a sandwich. If I found a sandwich in the woods like that, I probably wouldn't eat it, would you? 
If your answer is yes, it's probably the wrong answer. Sorbor and Tyke. Let's use them. I like this guy. I like the monkey. Ow. That monk, I mean, that board is pretty powerful. Ooh, level 11. Nice. What the heck? What is this guy? Pom pom? Let's go! How in the world is that a pom pom? Oh no, I'm poisoned. Okay, let's get out. Um I am getting hurt by these guys. Nito! All right. We leave in the forest? No. These giant mushrooms are blocking the way, Mr. Drippy. What should we do? What do you mean? Jump on the flipping things, of course. Oh, but won't they break? Nah, man. It'd take more than, the, than a slip of a lad like you landing on them to finish off these formidable fungi. You'll be fine. I sure hope so. I guess we won't have much choice, huh? We don't have much choice. I wasn't going to question it. Wait. I don't think I have to come... Do I have to come this way? I have to go down and around. This guy looks... Oh, he's running away. But he's so cute. Look at the little mushroom dude. Let's kick his butt. Nap cap. Let's go. You know... We're gonna stick with Oliver at first, and then... Aha! This nap cap is like the cutest little dude ever. I wanna see what he turns into. If, wait. I see that thing in there like Pokemon. They probably evolve in that. I gotta eat. Oh, I got full health there at the we end. Won! That was weird. Maybe I leveled up. I totally did. I was gonna say I need to go eat something. Nice. Alright, now our health is back up. Wait, what's this? There's nothing up here. Fine then. Oh, there's two paths here. I'm not going this way. I saw the boar. <laughs> Uh, no, I don't want to do... Yo. Totally stopped. Let's go up. Whoa. I keep almost getting hit by that dude. Emphasis on almost. You 
You miss me, miss your piggy. this jeepers what is this tidy it's a familiar egg ooh a familiar egg but didn't you tell me that familiars come from people's hearts that they do my lad but not only from there familiars can be born wherever there's plenty of what you might call life force see the sky, the sky, the sea, the forest, the field, it doesn't matter where it is, Ollie. Boy, when enough life force builds up, out they pop. In fact, they can even be born from ev everyday objects if they're used long enough and loved hard enough. I know, I know, mad, I know, mad, isn't it? Wow, life force sure sounds powerful. So this egg is made from life force building up here in the forest, huh? There's quick you are. Life force is a mysterious and potent energy field filled with wonder. But the results in it always so magical. Sometimes instead of fr friendly familiars, wild and vicious beasties are born instead. You mean the creatures that are always attacking us? They've the very same. The one, the only way to teach them not to go around attacking people is to fight back in it. Don't look so worried, man. We don't kill e kill the poor things. We just send them somewhere where they can't bother us for a while. What do you mean? I wonder what kind of creature will come of this egg. Sorry, my headset disconnected for a second. I can't wait to see it hatch. Well, you'll be waiting a while, Ollie boy. Look at the bits of tree around the egg the edge of it it's all withered they are seems like the forest life force has taken a turn for the sparse that must be why the fairies have all cleared out too eh sorry but if things stay as they are the egg isn't hatching any anytime soon gee that's so sad there must be something we can do mr drippy there is indeed ollie boy and it's right there in your hand do i have it do I have to spell it out? All you have to do is cast a spell that can unwither the withered bits, restore them to their former glory, if you know what I mean. Sure, Mr. Droopy, let me see a spell. Yeah, I get it. Rejuvenation spell. Seriously? Oh, I. Had to be closer. His twitching. Dighty, look, Ollie boy, it's hatching. Witness the miracle of new life. Jeepers creepers, should we help or something? Oh. Neato, it hatched. We did it, Mr. Droopy. Ah, there's, there's beautiful. There's nothing like a good hatching to get me welling up. Hee hee hee, stop it, it tickles. I think he likes you. Haha, uh -huh, he's cute. Okay, little one, we have to go now. Enjoy your life here in the forest, won't you? Hey, you aren't taking him with you, Ollie boy? He only just hatched, Mr. Drippy. I can't let him come with us, it's too dangerous. Yeah, you've got a point, I suppose. Fair enough. Right, oh, little, little E. Look after yourself, eh? Bye for now. But goodbye now and take care. Oh, I kind of want to take it. There are so many planes, like, there's just non stop, but I mean. So are the fires. Aha, uh -huh, you missed me. Whoa, it's sealed by some sort of magic and I keep accidentally hitting the same buttons.
Whoa. That looked powerful. Whoa. This guy looks cool. The big old empty. He's empty bitsy spider. Definitely. Oh no. Oh. Hi there. Well, look who it is. It's the little E from before. How 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 do you, young un? Young un. Did he follow us? Looks like he wants us to follow him now. Is there something he wants to show us? I wonder, he, maybe he's found some some of my fairy buddies, eh? <clears throat> Speaking of fairies, he looks a lot more like I'd imagine a fairy would look like than you, Mr. Derpy. Do we? Oh, he does, does he? Well, that just shows what you know, man, doesn't it? Hmm, the cheek. Totally just bypassing all these dudes. Going up here where there was nothing before. Ah, now there's something on the ground. Hey, this looks kind of familiar. Of course it does, you blonker. It's a page from the wizard's companion. It's And it's finders keepers around these parts. That's the law of the Junger Forest. You, you know what I mean. Just grab it. Neato. You received a page describing quick and growth spell. Okay, cool. Thanks for showing us the way. What's that? He's saying he reckons he could be useful to you, Ollie boy. Wants to tag along on our journey, do he does. But he's just a kid. He it's too dangerous. He's not just a kid. He's a baby. Ha, huh, cheeky little so-and-so. Look who's talking, he says. He means you're you're just a kid yourself, ain't it? And he's got a point. He really said that, but don't fret, Ollie. Boy creatures like him are born to be familiars and traveling around with wizards like yourself is what familiars do, isn't it? Gee, I guess. Okay, you can come with us. Yeah, you better give this little fellow a name then. That sealed that'll seal the deal, make you officially his master like. Sid. His name is Sid. I'm gonna keep that name. That's a cute little name. Hi, Sid. That's three whole familiars you got now, isn't it, Ollie boy? And look at that. This one can evade attacks and all. Yeah, okay. Cool. Well, we were supposed to go to the desert. Oh no. Ah, whoops. Come on. Well, let's try this new dude out, shall we? Oh no. It missed. Okay, no, 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 no. Get my ass kicked. Sorry to swear like that, but. That was horrible. I almost died. Sid learned water bomb. All right, guys. Well, 
Oh, look at this cool looking dude. He can't get me. Oh, he got me. Tyke. Let's do it. Healing touch. Healing touch. Fireball. You know, I wanna, no. I wanna test out Frostbite. 31 damage, noise. All right, guys. That was good. Is this the end of the forest? No. No, 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 I don't wanna fight you. There's a lot more, oh. It's right there, it looks like. Let's just hurry up and get there. Run past him. Oh no, this led nowhere. Ah, that led nowhere. We can do this. Yeah. I want to see if my f I spells are good against this guy. Seriously, Oliver? There you go. Nito! Yay, they both leveled up. Hey, a chest. Another sandwich. Ah, oh, great. I, oh, I thought this was the way to go. Well... Since it's not, I'm going to end this episode here. If you guys liked it, leave a like. If you want to see more, consider subscribing. But uh, I'll see you guys tomorrow for episode 7. Some more Nino Kuni action for you guys. Doing lots of it. I, f I don't know if I should just play this game or do another game in between kind of thing. Oh, another chest. This wasn't the way either. Just another chest. Um, well, like I said, I'll see you guys next time, though. Goodbye.